Your 2 News Oklahoma weather, sponsored by Executive Homes. Well, that rainy weather over the weekend didn't stop people from checking out the Jinx Plant and Herb Festival. The festival features over 100 booths filled with flowers, vegetables, and even wine and home decor. See, look, yeah, everyone out there. And you know what? I see someone in shorts, so it's still a little warm, you know. <laughs> yeah. Perfect for those flowers, the rain, right? However, we had that dreary weekend. So, Michael, we are hoping for some <laughs> sun, some nice temperatures. I know you are talking about earlier, there's still going to be some wind out there, so you got to take good with bad. Yeah, exactly right. But at least we get the sun to come back today. If you look here out in Owasso, you can see the back edge of some of the clouds here starting to move on out and it will be nice to enjoy some sunshine today. But a beautiful view right here on a Wade's RV weather camera network doesn't get much better than that on a Monday morning. The rain certainly has been moving out. Of course, uh, we are drying out, but it takes a little bit longer for that cloud cover to move out. And you can see the back edge here. Some of these clouds still working their way across eastern parts of Oklahoma. Still some heavy rain thunderstorms here in the parts of Texas. Those yellows and oranges that you're seeing here are the colder cloud tops, indicating that you're seeing storms developing high into the atmosphere, into the colder parts of the atmosphere. And that's why you got those bright yellows and oranges there. Still some heavy rain there, but all of that is starting to move on out. Now, our winds at the moment are about 10 to 20 miles per hour, but a few gusts pushing a little more than that. In fact, about 23 miles per hour, the last wind gust in Tulsa at check, uh, 26 miles per hour in Muskogee. So we're seeing some of those wind speeds picking up this morning, and that's about where we'll keep it as we go through the afternoon. Temperatures are in the 40s to the north, 50s as you head to the south. If you're taking the dogs out for a walk, jackets will certainly be needed this morning, but sunshine is in the forecast once we get these clouds out of here. Again, it's going to be nice and sunny all day, so the sunglasses will come in handy as well. Still cool as you head into lunchtime, 55 degrees, and we'll work our way into the mid 60s by later this afternoon. It will be a pleasant day for any plans that you do have later on today. Now, tonight we'll get a little chilly down to 42 in Tulsa tomorrow morning, and some of those favored spots, especially to the north, where we get a little bit cooler, light winds, clear skies, allow those temperatures to drop, may get a little patchy frost farther to the north, won't be very widespread. Rain chances do increase on Thursday. A few showers and thunderstorms will be possible. I think north will have the higher chance, but we'll continue to fine tune that as we get a little bit closer into your Thursday plans, and we'll leave a chance for a few showers and storms by late Friday. Timing still needs to be worked out, but we may have an opportunity for a few showers and thunderstorms going into your weekend plans as well. So that'll be something we'll have to keep a close eye on for any plans you've got this weekend.